Hello, this is Movie Reviews by JT, and I got another review for you, Slumber Party Massacre. Uh, this movie is stuff is the um, modern reimagining of the original 1982's film. It's uh, this movie premiered at the Fantastic Fest on September 27. Um, this movie had a lot of violence, and it's crazy. And I like the only thing negative about this film was was the dialogue. It's some of the dialogue for like comedy and stuff. Then then no need for that and stuff. It was just ridiculous the dialogue. So the movie starts off in 1993. Trish Devereaux was the only survivor of a massacre when she stopped while storm a psychopath with a power drill. During a summer party in Holly Spring, there three decades later, Trish Dora Dana is all to a girl weekend where friends Ashley, me, and Bianca, me sister Alex, stoles away and and actually is set to join them. The car breaks down and the girls are forced to go to the same campground we named Jolly Fall Spring, where Trish and Connor Wall Storm history soon set to repeat itself when Dana and the girls decided to have their summer party at the cabin. <laughs> yeah, so now her daughter Trish now is it starts going out to that same area where where she was at back in nineteen ninety three decades ago. And then this stuff as I and one of the girls' sister was in the um in back of the Jeep and started the Jeep broke down. They all go to the cabinet, time the party and stuff. And stuff until Alice was stone stone out of the house and stuff. Way across the street to the house across the street across the river over there, the cabinet, the same cabin as it's like you can tell it's the same cabin. That um, Dana's mother was and stuff. And the mechanic guy who was fixing a car came to the house trying to uh, tell him about something. And, and he see um, Bob Storm staring at him and stuff. And he decided to go back in his truck. And then you see um, Alice walking out in the woods. She opened the truck, the door saw the truck, the guy. The mechanic guy's eyes was ripped out of the stuff. His eyes were gone, bleed all over Alice. She runs back into the hall, uh, back to the house to tell her about dead guy and stuff. And everything, the mechanic guy and stuff. And they was all up there trying to um, kill Wild Storm and stuff. They had um, weapons and everything, all the other girls and stuff. Then some two guys knocked on the door. There was they do these um horror trip things and stuff. A whole bunch of guys up there and stuff. And then one of them see them have weapons. They decided to leave. The one with the glasses. They decided to go back up, go back to the cabin and stuff. And one of the guys get murdered by Wild Storm and stuff. And then the girls and stuff, but the stuff on um, pop. They decided to go out and start and power goes out in the cabin and one of the other guys get murdered by Wild Storm, drill right to his head and and stuff. And the other two guys leave, one of the girls was doing stuff. And then they decided to attack. They started to see Wild Storm and stuff and um Dana uh, Trish's daughter broke Wild Storm um, doing um drill with the nine. And start and everybody start start beating on them and starting and hitting them and starting you know, killing them and, and outside come out and stab him. he was already dead. Kept stabbing him, stabbing him, stabbing him all over. And stuff. And he was dead and it was the morning he was dead and started and showed he was dead. They all go back out and told one of the other girls to watch the body and stuff and watch. Watch him and stuff. And then then one of the guys this dog took a shower and he gets killed in the shower, he dies, and um another one of the girls gets killed, one of the girls fishing it, um the Jeep thing gets killed, when somebody turned on the engine and the Jeep and killed him in the engine with the fan things, die the other girls die with 
Adele went through her eye and kills her. And, and suddenly Alex gets sick of eating those cookies. And Dana was obviously the, the old lady, the lady that um, that they was talking to at the store or at the gas station, trying to be Bob Storm's mother. And she was blaming them for getting him all wild up. And stuff. And then they, um, Dana's mother called Trish finished it while I'm killing um, Wild Storms' about mother on um, Trist took the book and um, part of the drill and sticker and, and in the movie and stuff. The movie was, as I said, was a lot of violence. I liked it and stuff. It's just the dialogue didn't make any sense. It was just comedy. I don't like comedy dialogue stuff. So, yeah, so that was the only thing that put me off. I guess Summer Party Massacre um, at eight out of four would have been higher with the dialogue, though. But yeah, so that's my review for Slumber Party Massacre. Bye, bye.